YouTube, you feel me? We back with another video. I wanna say thank you to y'all boys and girls for showing me love to these videos, you know, for the opposite gender, one and two. One has 2.3K and the other one has 3K, you feel me? And then the other video I made is at 900. Y'all keep showing love, man, I appreciate that. But in further ado, let's get into this video, man. Let's get let's get right up into this Q and A. No wasting no more time with y'all boys for real. Um, what made me want to do YouTube? What really want me to make YouTube videos was like my cameraman. He really kind of like motivated me to do YouTube because he was like, "Oh, you know a lot of people, and a lot of people could be in your YouTube videos." And I was like, "Yeah, you you know you're right." So me and him, we just started brainstorming, you know, making like you know, making, like, a, a channel name for me and stuff like that. And he was like, why you don't use your Instagram tag? I mean, um, Instagram name. And I was like, yeah, you're right. I could do that. You feel me? So I just used my Instagram name for my YouTube name, you feel me? Because it's kind of convenient, you know what I'm saying? And he helped me make my banner, you know, and stuff like that, you know. Okay, man, you watching this, man. I appreciate you, bro. For real, I appreciate you. You know, ain't nothing but the top for us, you know what I'm saying? But... Yeah, that's what made me get into YouTube, so, you know what I'm saying? Him, basically, so, you know. All right, um, do you believe in true love? No, I don't really believe in true love because I feel like these girls nowadays, they just, they really don't want to, like, be in love with us, young, young men. You feel me? Because they be mostly just be out here. They be on some grimy stuff. You feel me? They all, all they think about is just sex and all this other stuff. You feel me? I'm not coming at y'all females no type of way. I'm just saying, you know, in my perspective, you feel me? How y'all be showing it. But, you know, we ain't going to talk about that. We're going to move on to the next question, though. Um, Who are your t top three favorite rappers? Um, G Herbo, Lil Baby, and Yak. Yeah, you feel me? Those are my three. Those are my top three. And J Dot, nah, yeah, I'm gonna put on yeah, J Dot. You feel me? My top four. I'm just, I just gave y'all my top four, not my top three, my top four. Um, what are your goals for this year? My goals this year is just to push out more videos for y'all because I know y'all been talking about, oh, bro, why you not pushing out no more videos? What's going on? What you doing? You feel me? I'm gonna be trying to be more consistent. Y'all know how YB be dropping them music videos for y'all YB fans, man. You know how he be dropping back to back. I'm gonna try to be like that. I'm gonna try to be dropping back to back. You feel me? So y'all gonna be getting them good, them good ass quality. You feel me? I'm gonna try to do more. I'm gonna try to like step out my comfort zone and do collabs and stuff like other YouTubers. You feel me? So we gonna try to get that cracking this year too. Also, you feel me? I have I have a collab, but I gotta see what she doing before we even start getting into the collab. But yeah. Um, who was your first kiss? My first kiss was in elementary school. I just don't, I don't remember a lot from elementary school. I don't remember how, how we did it. You feel me? Cause it meant so long, but on to the next one though. Um, what are the three things on your bucket list? I want to kind of go, I want to do bull riding. I want to ride a bull. Um, I want to go. I want to walk on the tightrope and I want to go skydiving. Mean, those are my big three right there. My big three I want to do on my bucket list. So that's what I'm gonna try to do this year or try to accomplish this year. So at least at least one of them. I'm gonna try to do at least one of them. You know what I'm saying? Um, who is? Oh, do I have a favorite crush? I mean, favorite ex? Oh my bad. Um, no, I don't have no favorite ex. You know what I'm saying? No. Wait, do I? Hell no, I don't. Um, who is my celebrity crush? FTN Bay. You feel me? That's my crush right there, man. Y'all can tell because I know y'all be seen on the Instagram. Oh, who she is? You feel me? That's my crush. You know what I'm saying? Um, do I have plans to have any kids anytime soon? I don't want no kids right now. I'm trying to live life. I'm trying to put, you know, maybe later on in the road. When I financially stable to have kids, yeah, cool. You know what I'm saying? Um, what was my longest relationship? Ooh, my longest relationship was like probably like a year. You know what I'm saying? That was probably like my longest relationship, but it was with this girl way back then, way back then. I want to say like 2019 to 2020. Yeah, that was like my longest relationship. 
Do you enjoy shopping at the mall or online? I like to shop. So it depends. It really depends with me, really. Sometimes I go to like a store or something, they don't have my size. Or they out of like the thing I want. I either go online and I find it and then I get it, you know what I'm saying? So it's like a mix of both, you know what I'm saying? So I would say I like to do both. I like to shop online and go shopping, regular shopping. Um, How do you feel doing YouTube? This YouTube stuff, I'm not really a YouTube person. I'm trying to get more into it. I'm trying to be like a more YouTube person, you know what I'm saying? But it's good. It's like YouTube really my therapy, you feel me? You know, y'all might think I sound crazy, but it's really my therapy for real. But I like doing videos for y'all. It makes me feel good. I know it makes y'all feel good at home, whoever watching it and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, so this is like, it's, it's pretty cool doing YouTube. It's pretty cool. Um, who can you tell everything to? My people really, cause my people, they, they would never like go around telling anything or saying anything, they just keep it to themselves, you feel me? Like, that's what I want. I don't want nobody to just be like, I'm going around telling all my business, because, you know, that's not your business, you know what I'm saying? Maybe if we close, maybe I'll tell you if we close, but if we ain't close, then you ain't, ain't going to get too much, you know what I'm saying? Um, What is something you want to approve on? <sighs> what is something I want to approve on this year? Like, dang. I kind of want to approve on, like, just... Give me all the best of videos, you feel me? And just working on my my mental health because, you know, mental health is a real big part. Those are the two things I really want to improve on this year. Um, Have you ever cheated? Yeah, I cheated. I cheated on this one girl, but she was cheating on me, though. So, you know, I had to, I just had to match her energy, you know what I'm saying? I know some of y'all going to be in the comments. Oh, oh, you cheat. Oh, da, da, da. No, I don't do that no more. That was the old me. And that was like, what? The last time I cheated was like 2019. 2019, that's like, that's like a whole decade ago. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? That was like the last time I cheated. Shit. Um, what is the most embarrassing thing you did? Um, most embarrassing thing. My brother, he was chasing me and I had ran into like a wall and I had hit my head. And I had like, had a fat knot. And then they were just laughing at me because I had hit my head. You know what I'm saying? And it really, and it hurt it too. It's like the way how I hit the wall. Like the wall is right here, right? And this is me running. And I went like, boom. And I was like, oh, you feel me? And I had a big, like the knot wasn't small. It wasn't like no small baby knot. It was like big. It was like, dang. It was like that boy got messed up. My brother was calling me for like a couple of days. When I had the knot, and I was like, you feel me? So, yeah. That's the most embarrassing thing. Um, How many bodies do you have? I have I have zero, really. I have zero. I don't have, you know, zero bodies. Big zero. Um, What is the nastiest thing you ever seen? The nastiest thing I ever seen was one of my friends. He had threw up. And like, no, this was like when I was doing track and field, like I was a freshman and it was this kid I knew because, you know, we used to have lunch together when I was in school and we had track practice and our coach, he used to work us to death, you know what I'm saying? And we had, we had just got done running like five miles and he had, he had like went over by the bush and he just started throwing up and I'm like, I was like, whoa, I was like, what he doing, you feel me? Cause I didn't know what he was doing. I thought he was just gonna like, just sit down on the ground for a little minute. You know what I'm saying? But he would, but like, I had turned my head and I just seen him throwing up. I was like, oh my God. And then like, if I see somebody throw it, that one would make me throw up, you feel me? That's, you know, that, that's not it, you know what I'm saying? That's not it. But um, yeah, that's the nastiest thing I've ever seen. What is the last time you were sick? When was the last time I was sick? I want to say the last time I was sick was probably like Thanksgiving last yeah Thanksgiving of last year. That was that's when I was sick. I wasn't really I wasn't sick that bad, but I just couldn't like I just had like a little stuffy nose, a little sore throat. You know what I'm saying? Not nothing too major. Um, what is your favorite drinks? This this one right here, you feel me? The little Mountain Dew, if y'all can see that. 
you know what I'm saying? That bit, that bit buzz, you know what I'm saying? I know it's spilling a little bit, you know what I'm saying? But it's, it's all right, though. Um, and F Fiji water, I drink that too. Body armor. Um, let me see. Gator I love Gatorade. I love Gatorade. Don't get me wrong, Gatorade. Um, that's pretty much it. That's all I drink, really. What fear do you want to com conquer this year? A fear I want to conquer this year is skydiving. That's what I really want to do this year. Like that's that's like a major thing I really want to conquer this year. Before like you know, um, what is your favorite social media? I don't have one, but if I had to choose one, I would really say probably Instagram, Twitter. Those are like my two favorites, and and TikTok too. And TikTok, but I don't really be on TikTok, but I'm gonna try to be on it more often. Who do you text the most? My cameraman, some of my closest friends, and my mom, my grandma, and my brothers. That's pretty much it. That's the only people I text, really. But, you know, that's I guess that's it for the Q&A, y'all. I answer questions. If y'all want part two to this Q&A, comment down below. I want part two, and I'll do another part two. I'll come back here, sit down. You know, I read more questions and, you know, that's it. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe on this video. But, you know, man, I know I got to say this again. I know y'all, you know what I'm saying? Thank you for the 3K, man. Y'all keep running up the videos, man. But your boy's out, though. You feel me?